One easy way to reach more audience online is to set up a multilingual WordPress website. I'll show you how to do this quickly using the Polylang plugin. Once the installation is complete, you'll find a new menu item called Languages in your WordPress dashboard. First step to do is to set up all the languages you are planning to use. Select one option from the drop-down list, complete all the fields below, choose the text direction for the language, the perfect flag, the position of the language in the language switcher and hit add new language. Repeat the process for all additional languages you wish to use. In the next tab we have the option to manually set strings translations. Moving on to the next section called settings, you have more options to decide how your URLs will look like, activate the browser language detection when the front page is visited, languages and translations for media, you can activate the languages and translations management for the custom post types and taxonomies. Here are some important synchronization options that will allow you to maintain the exact same values of meta content between the translations of a post or page. The final option here is to decide whether to remove all data when deleting the Polyland plugin. Here comes the interesting part. LingoTech allow you to automatically translate your site, you can activate a translation management system or request professional translation. And for this you need to install another plugin by hitting the activate blue button. In order to use these options you need to create a LingoTech account and connect it with your WordPress website. After all set and done, go to appearance menu. Here you need to create menus for all the languages you are using. Click on create a new menu link, set a menu name, build the same structure by dragging the same elements from the main menu and translate every item in the required language. This element will allow your visitors to switch between languages. Don't forget to thick the primary menu option with the same language and hit save menu on finish. Repeat the same process for every new language you are planning to use. This is how your language switcher will look and work in your menu. Now I'll show you how to set different languages for your content in posts or pages. Add a new English post by setting the English title, the English text content, in this case I'll use dummy text to move fast forward and hit the save draft button. Now hit the plus button near the language flag you are planning your content to translate in. If this will be Spanish, manually translate the post title, the text content and save it as draft. Do the same for all languages you are using. When you are ready, just hit the blue publish button for all of your translated content. Now you can place a language switcher in your sidebar by going to Appearance Widgets. Just drag the language switcher to your preferred location, set things up and hit save. Now you can see it in action by visualizing the content just created in the previous step. It's amazing that this plugin will automatically translate some of your WordPress elements. Now, because you have a multilingual WordPress website ready using the Polylang plugin, feel free to play around with the options to open the way for your content to reach new readers. Thanks for watching. Feel free to post a comment, give us a like and subscribe.